been going through the workout and it's easy, you fine, you're okay, you're not struggling. You see how I get up on that last rep of my push-up. You're not doing anything for growth. At most, you're doing something to stay the same. You know what I'm saying? To grow, you have to do something you've never done before. Yes, sir! What's good, y'all? It's Jay, and today I'm bringing you guys a redo of the push-up Imam routine. One, because it was mad loud in the gym, so I didn't like the background noise, nothing like that. Two, I also didn't like how I performed in the workout. Y'all seen it. If you didn't see it, go check it out right now. But I started with the red band. I had dropped to the peach band. I had to, you know, it's just old so Just watch the video, bro. Anyway, redo right here. Let's go. Now, what I want to do is I want to keep the red band. I don't want to switch it out at all during this routine, but I'm going to drop the number to seven and see how that goes. Y'all going to witness the struggle. Follow along with me if you'd like to. We got seven minutes on the clock right here, so I'm about to start it up right now. I got nine seconds, we're gonna get it. Seven reps every minute. Now you can see how I'm doing my push-ups. I'm trying to keep the control throughout the entire movement. I'm trying to focus on my breathing. I'm inhaling on the way down. I'm exhaling on my way up. We're not rushing through the movement. Anybody that does this with me, we're not rushing through it. We're not pumping it out in half a second. Um, doing a fast pace in school and everything we do on high reps, but I just really want to focus on my muscle contraction, the mind muscle connection, to make sure I feel the squeeze in everything that I'm doing. So that's what I'm focused on. 15 seconds. The pace that I'm going, I see it's getting hard, like maybe my guess would be the fourth or fifth set. It's gonna be real embarrassing though if it's hard on the third. But fourth or fifth set, I think it's gonna start kicking in. I'm gonna have to start breaking it up. That's two steps down. Five, three, two, let's go. catching my breath in between each set. I have a tendency when I work out to not breathe enough, like to hold my breath through a lot of my reps. It's been my problem throughout all the years. When I've been training since I was like 16, 17, but I would always like hold my breath and mess it up. That's why I'm really focusing on it now. My cardio is always tough, I can't lie to you. But I always been good at jump the rope. At the tricks, breathe still sucks. Four sets, just like I said. I said, what, four to five? So four I did straight, but that was tough. Five, I might break, but let's try not to. Three more minutes. That's six. Come on, don't break, don't break. Wow. God. I'm definitely breaking on six because I gave everything I had on that set. Ten seconds left. Uh, going into six set. Two more to go. Yep, there it is. That's four. Three more reps. If you're going through the workout and it's easy, 
you find you're okay, you're not struggling, you see how I get up on that last rep on my push up, you're not doing anything for growth. At most, you're doing something to stay the same. You know what I'm saying? To grow, you have to do something you've never done before. Remember that. Not just for working out, but for everything in life. Three seconds. Last set. Come on. I ain't gonna lie, I think that was five. Might have been a four. I think five, but because I'm unsure, it's better to underestimate what I did. Just get more money, get more reps, get more gains for myself. So I'm gonna say it was four. I'm gonna look back at the camp at the uh, recording, see if it was really five, but if it was, y'all gonna get an extra rep. I'm gonna three more. I finished in 6 minutes 50 seconds. I hope you followed along. If you didn't, rewind the video back. Do it yourself. Pick a number. Control the reps. Get it done. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'm Jay and I'm out.